Now that I have the seat done, I can put in the seat belts. So I'm going to do that with a combination of lines and arcs. And I'm going to pick, I'm going to get out of fill here, pick my, um, what I want my seat belt to look like. And then this one is going to go up around here. And I'm going to make that 1 16th of an inch. It's kind of thick. So um, that is four and a half points. And <clears throat> with line, I'm going to glue that this to the back of the car. Okay, so it gets a nice glue there. Then it's going to come over here. Now this starts to get a little tricky. Um, I do an arc here. And generally what I say is if you do two arcs here, and I'm in the wrong arc, a three-point arc, that's what we used before. Um, the easiest way is just to erase this. And then make sure I'm in the right arc. Okay, so click at the first starting point. I'm going to right click here and going to go with object snap and get out of grid snap. So I just right click. I did it on the line. And that way I'll know I'm doing it on the line. Right. And then if I start another arc right there, and then right here, and then right here. That's pretty good. There's no way to really get rid of, well, there probably are ways, but we aren't going to worry about a little gap like that one up there. And then I'm going to go to line, and I'm going to draw this straight down. It's going to get glued here, right to the, let me move this up, right down to the foam core. Whoops. Oh, I know. Oh, okay, there we go. Now, I want to get back into grid snap and out of object snap. But that's the way that will look over there. Again, we won't worry about that little gap up there. It's very small. And what will that look like going over the on the top view, going over the egg? Well, that's going to be a big, uh, fairly thick line, uh, 3 eighths of an inch. And that um, is 27 points. And I'm just going to draw that from the back of the, actually over here. Right, that sticks out a little ways there, so one sixteenth of an inch, and then we're going to bring it right there, right in front of the egg. Okay, so then I can draw in my other seat belt. This one probably will be made out of Velcro. And the one going around it is going to probably be made out of elastic. I think I'll make that yellow. So I'll really match in there. Again, you can use whatever colors you'd like to. And I'm going to do the hard part first. Well, no, I already have this set to 27 points. So I'm going to put this right around the midsection of the egg. Um, and then... Uh, that the velcro usually will go over that, so I'll just send that. That's pretty strange looking anyway, so I'll send that to the back. Um, arrange, send backward, and that looks right. Okay, so um, and if I send it to the back, it goes all the way to the back, and these things start to go over it. But if I just send it backwards in one step, then I'm all set in my layering. Now I'm going to draw going around here. It's very similar to up there. It's actually a little easier. So I'm going to make that a, uh, a 16th of an inch, uh, 4.5. And I'm going to get online. It's going to get from here. Remember, this is, you know, that part of the seat going around the seat. Now I can bring it right over here. And now I can pick an arc. And 
and I want to get on uh, object snap and out of grid snap and kind of go halfway around there and then right there. And then I have completed that um, part. Um, if I come back out here and look at that, then there are my, there's my seat egg and two seat belts. And it should be all set.